Hippos are the third largest living land mammal on the planet, and they are ferocious. But ferocious doesn't mean they don't have enemies that are not afraid of them. During altercations, they often will win battles against their foes, but sometimes they won't. So if you want to see how certain animals defeat hippos, this is it, so let's get started. A hippo is seen trying to run away from a hungry male lion in the open field when the lion jumps on the hippo's back. The hippo is young and not fast or strong enough to escape. At first, it seemed like the hippo was ready to confront the lion, but when he made the mistake of turning his back on the feline, it was game over. Scarface, the dominant male of the marsh pride in the Maasai Mara, is enjoying its kill he just made overnight. A young hippo that did not make it back into his waterhole was apprehended by the big cat, and with no other adult hippos nearby, it was checkmate in an instant. An astonishing video of a wounded hippo fighting five adult lions was captured by a wildlife ranger. Two male lions were sleeping on the ridgeline above the large hippo, which was trying to find a restricted supply of water. The hippo's antics startled the male lions, who summoned their pride, which arrived with three lionesses and four pups. The adult predators went to work on the hippo's back, biting and scratching at it to bring it down. The voracious pride seemed to have bitten off more than it could chew as the hippo fought its way to safety. The young hippo in this video wandered off at the wrong time of the night and became easy prey for the pride of hungry lions. There's never an appropriate time to wander off when you live in the bush, but I guess you really don't want to do so at night. You can see the outcome of a midnight stroll in the video. These male lions are attacking a massive hippo, which has its calf right next to it. For the time being, they are unconcerned about the calf and continue to devour flesh from the hippo's back by repeatedly biting into it. It'll only be a matter of time before this hippo succumbs to the onslaught, and once that happens, I'm confident the calf will be next. Onlookers reported that the calf was in effect killed the same way his mother was. It was a big time special for the lions, as they got two for the price of one. These two male lions are feeding on what looks like a big bowl of hippo soup and they are taking advantage of it. The hippo can be seen kicking out his hind legs to try and remove the lions, just like some of the old time wrestlers would do, but unfortunately for the young hippo, it doesn't work. An entire pride is feasting on a hippo in this video, and there are so many lions it's difficult to even see the hippo, except perhaps for its legs, swinging up in the air as it tries to fend off the horde of felines biting into its body. This large animal will surely feed the entire family. An injured hippo lays almost still in a water hole while hyenas dig into its body. The hippo tries one last time to get up to try and escape, but when the weakened animal realizes it simply doesn't have the necessary energy to do so, he just gives up and falls on his side, offering himself as an all-you-can-eat buffet to the hyenas. The hyenas couldn't be happier as they gorge on a meal that could feed the entire cackle. Only the most daring of Africa's predators will take on a fully grown hippo. With 50 centimeter teeth and thick, tire-like skin, these large herbivores are notoriously cantankerous and one of the continent's most dangerous creatures. These facts do not deter these hyenas from trying to take the animal down, but considering the hippo is in pretty good shape, the hyenas will need to call for reinforcements if they hope to be successful. As much as a weak and sick is an easy target, a healthy and aggressive one is an entirely different story. While its friends devour him, this hyena is whispering something into the hippo's ear. It's telling the hippo they're all hungry in case he didn't realize it. Because the hippo is clearly sick, the hyena's whispers go unanswered. The way this hyena grabs a hippo calf by the mouth and pulls on it is merciless. Another, calmer hyena arrives and watches the ordeal the hippo calf is subjugated to and doesn't seem to care, as long as it gets a piece of the pie. A sighting such as this one is difficult to forget when a clan of hungry hyenas tenaciously pursue a hippo calf in a standoff that lasts several hours. Onlookers were kept on the edge of their seats, 
as the hyenas tried to attack the hippo, which only had a small body of water, keeping it safe from their ferocious, snapping jaws. Nonetheless, the young hippo managed to escape in the end in a scene that will forever stand out in the minds of all who saw it. If you think this hippo is dead, think again. It's still alive, but just barely. And that's why the hyenas are enjoying this food fest without any resistance from the massive animal. It's sad to see such a scene, but you can't blame the hyenas for eating food that's free and served on a silver platter. On his way back home, after wandering off on his own, a young hippo is harassed by a few hyenas that try biting his rear end and tail. The animals are followed by dozens of vehicles with curious onlookers aboard who can't wait to see the outcome as the hippo continues his journey on the dirt road. One of the hyenas is stubborn and doesn't stop pulling on the animal's tail, but it was later reported that the hippo eventually made it back to his parents alive, and news was that he was grounded for months after his little escapade. A hippo calf is attacked by a large crocodile in this video under the watchful eyes of a lion. The video is short and sweet, but we don't see the outcome of the encounter. I don't think I have ever seen such a massive crocodile in my life, I'm not talking about how long it is, but really how thick the reptile is. Perhaps it's because it's trying to swallow a hippo calf carcass whole, and part of the hippo is already inside its body. This crocodile may need emergency surgery if the hippo is stuck, and honestly, it looks like it is. The baby crocodile in this video was dead when the crocodile found it and picked it up and started swimming downstream with it. The crocodile swam into a hippo pod and then grabbed the hippo. The last bit of video when the crocodile smashed the tenderized baby hippo occurred about a week later. Wildlife enthusiasts happened to come across some crocodiles eating a baby hippo killed during their safari. This is another example of efficient predators, only in the water this time. Crocodiles would not attack an adult hippo since it would be very difficult to take down. And the theory was that this baby hippo must have strayed out on its own to be killed this way. Hippos try to find deep pools of water to protect them from the sun and carry their weight. The spot is ideal if you can ignore the lions. Hot and stressed and soon enough, 50 hippos have piled in, but this pool already has an owner, a dominant hippo. The newcomers slip in as quietly as they can, while the dominant hippo displays splattering dung, stating he's the boss, and his chomping jaws demonstrate he is not to be messed with. A younger hippo challenges him, and he is stronger than he is. They battle it out for more than an hour, and although the young challenger gave the resident bull a run for his money, he is defeated. The old guy retains his kingdom for the time being. In this video, two male hippos are going to war over territory and mates. The combatants can weigh two tons. It's a tail-biting clash of the titans, and only one of the two gladiators will win. The loser will be banned and ostracized from the herd. Hippos fight because they are aggressively territorial. Hippos will use their feces to mark their territory and then protect it against other hippos. They may also quarrel over a mate. As a male hippo attempts to court a female, he becomes violent toward any other males in the vicinity. The two hippos will battle if another male tries to take away his domain. Hippos are also fiercely protective of their calves and might turn aggressive if they believe their youngster is in danger. When two male hippos fight, they will try to gore each other with their tusks. This is quite dangerous since hippos can readily puncture one another's organs. Female hippos can fight as well, but they rarely utilize their tusks. Instead, they will collide with their tails. Out of the water, this hippo will soon overheat, but the water hole is already full. It may not look very inviting, as the ox peckers ravage cracks in their delicate skin, and 20 tons of waste a day has turned the water hole into a cesspit. But this hellhole could save his life if he's allowed in. The hippos are territorial, and the resident bull is bigger than his opponent, but the outsider is desperate. Five tons of hippo clash, testing bulk, bite size, and brute force. The outsider accepts defeat and must venture into the unknown as the stranglehold of drought tightens. I guess fights and arguments between hippos don't only happen in the wild. These two hippos try to show their dominance to each other at a zoo. I guess the natural nature of the hippos doesn't change even when they're held in captivity. 
they still want to run things wherever they may reside. These two males take their battle from the water to the sandy beaches, where one of the males becomes exhausted and abandons the fight and tries to run away. The other hippo doesn't let up and chases him back into the water where the chase ends. Hippos are extremely territorial, and if one male tries to invade the territory of another, there will be tension and eventually conflict. Hippos will not back down in the face of any challenge. Their large teeth are known to deliver a nasty bite when they open their mouths and attempt to chomp their opponent. Their teeth clash and the clamor is audible. One of the hippos surrenders and walks away. As you can see at the beginning of this video, a bull was walking down into the pan and into another bull's territory when they both found their match that day. The two bulls were engaged in a full-out battle for over two hours as they roared and attacked each other. This was one sighting onlookers just couldn't leave. Two male hippos having a territorial dispute duped it out at Shumba Plains in Zambia. Wildlife enthusiasts were sitting in a small boat as the two males came within feet of their boat in crocodile-infested waters. Luckily, their engine started at the last minute and the hippo went in a different direction. In our thumbnail, we could see a hippo full of oxpeckers on its body doing their thing. In addition to eating ticks and other external parasites, the oxpeckers serve as a watchman for the mammals around them. When danger approaches, the birds let out a hissing call which alerts their host to a potential and nearby predatory threat, giving the host enough time to fight or flee. In most cases, oxpeckers provide a valuable service for many animals, particularly when they feed on the fleas, ticks, and blood-sucking flies, while the mammal gets a free skin and parasite control treatment. But for some animals, the oxpecker can be trouble when consuming too much blood from an open wound, causing it to open, just like the hippo in this video. This old hippo bull has seen better days as he slowly paces uneasily down the riverbank and into the water. This battle scars are attracting a flock of oxpeckers as they feed on the rotting flesh from his wounds. This is truly a gruesome scene to watch. Oxpeckers perform a valuable service to hippos, keeping their skin free of ticks and dead skin, but they've also been known to keep host wounds open so they can feed off the flesh. The oxpecker slashes the hippos, which causes damage. The bird takes care of the cuts and checks to make sure there are no insects inside, but they are still left exposed and are particularly vulnerable to other sorts of infection. A colossal hippo is attempting to find some peace and quiet in this watering hole, but guess who shows up to disrupt the fun? A pack of wild dogs, of course, always on the lookout for an opportunity. The wild dogs don't really do much but crack the hippo's chops. Wild dogs don't favor hippos as prey, but they both loathe each other. Hippos and wild dogs are known for chasing each other while attempting to grab impala or other prey, which is why they don't get along. I'm not sure if hippos fear wild dogs, but they sure do find them bothersome, and boy are the wild dogs in this video annoying this hippo to the tilt. When a pack of wild dogs tried following an impala in a waterhole owned by a huge and ferocious hippo, the massive beast attacked and killed the impala, throwing the animal into the air right in front of the hungry dogs that were helpless, watching their meal being handled this way and slowly slipping away from their dining room table. These wild dogs harass the massive hippo in this video simply because it's fun. It's not as if the dogs will gain anything from this encounter other than some entertainment. Because this is such a large and strong hippo, the wild dogs would take an enormous risk trying to take it down, which is unlikely. So, how do the dogs behave? They conclude that they've wasted enough of their time, and this hippo's time as well, and decide to call it a day. This elephant in must chases these hippos away, but a small hippo calf remains in the area, dangerously close to the elephant. The elephant is perplexed as the baby hippo moves around but does not leave. Finally, the baby hippo jumps into the water and swims away. Mom and her baby elephant attempted to cross the river, but the hippos harassed and attacked the small elephant, causing mom to become enraged and attack the hippos with her tusks on the other side. Once the hippos were driven out, the mother and baby elephant crossed the river to the other side of the riverbank after driving them out. A hippo defies an elephant when it enters a tiny waterhole to take a bath. The elephant isn't happy but doesn't attack the hippo as it watches the animal walk in the water and lie down, 
as if he owns it. Hippos don't like it when other animals enter their water holes, but when a massive elephant like the one in our video decides to take a bath in their water hole, all the hippos can do is watch and keep their mouths shut and get out of the way, even though they're upset. When a rhino meets a hippo in the bush in the middle of the night, it seems that the rhino listens to the hippo and walks away, but the hippo isn't convinced that the rhino understands, so he follows him to make sure he is leaving for good. This video was recorded in the Longwa Valley in Zambia. Most likely the hippo bull defeated and chased off the previous ruling bull. He found a calf within the pod that wasn't his. His gene dominance told him to reproduce with as many hippo cows as possible. The hippo cow with a newborn won't be receptive for the next two years. So to get her in estrus, he needed to kill the calf. So the suckling stops and the biological system of the cow will tell her she lost the baby and will start ovulating soon after that. The new ruling bull never knows how long he will sit on his hard-earned throne of dominance, so he needs to get to the point quickly from a genetic point of view. No time to waste nor seeing calves grow up, which are not his. A male hippo can be seen attacking a baby hippo in a waterhole, and it doesn't look like mom or any other hippo is there to help the young, defenseless calf. Male hippos often kill young hippo calves to force their moms to go into estrus so they can reproduce as quickly as possible. Dominant males do not sit on the throne for long, so they know they must hurry to create as many babies as possible. This hippo opens its lips wide in this video as if to warn the buffalo of an impending attack, yet the buffalo does not budge. With its mouth extended, the hippo charges the buffalo, attempting to crush it as it drives it into the water. Besides being pushed around, the buffalo doesn't do much. We all know how territorial hippos are, and we have seen how ready they are to fight any animal in the bush. Well, it doesn't seem entirely true, and this video proves it. Look at the way these three hippos turn around in panic and run back into the water as if they've seen a ghost. At first, I couldn't see what it was that scared them this way, but when I looked again, I spotted a goose. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, all it took was a goose to scare the living daylights out of these massive beasts. Territorial, my eye. When a leopard becomes a little too ambitious for his own good, he quickly finds out what mommy hippo was made of and forgets about his original objective, which was to snatch the young calf. I'm even surprised the big cat dared to do what he did. He probably only focused on the calf and forgot about mom, or maybe he thought he was quick enough to snatch the calf without mom being able to chase him. He probably forgot that hippo calves still weigh a lot, so it's not like he was going to be able to carry it up a tree. Anyhow, I guess he learned his lesson for the next time he encounters a hippo calf and his mom. You don't see this every day, but the leopard in this video managed to snatch and pull a young hippo calf out of the water. The young hippo must have wandered off because this would not have happened had his mother been right next to him. However, it can also be that the hippo was already dead when the big cat grabbed it. A male lion that finds a hippo carcass finds out quickly that biting through a hippo carcass isn't easy. Of course, this carcass may have been laying there for days, making it even harder to rip out flesh. There are no animals that lions can't take down when they work together, and hippos are no exception, as you could see in this video. A few male lions leap onto the back of a massive hippo, and the hippo is rendered defenseless in no time. The lions are really drilling a hole into the hippo's back flesh, and the hippo isn't even trying to move. Because this hippo's behavior is unusual, I believe he is unwell or injured. A hippo calf was quickly turned into lunch by this lion, as the feline can be seen pulling the young hippo through the dirt. The feline can be seen enjoying its kill, and it looks finger licking good. We have seen hippos in all types of situations, but one thing is clear, no matter how dangerous and scary these animals are, they're not invulnerable. Which one was your favorite? Why don't you let us know in the comments below? And well, that's it for now. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be a part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our new videos as soon as they're uploaded. Thanks for watching and see you next time.